So several months back, I decided I wanted to switch to uh, ethanol eventually, and NizTune offered a feature pack that uh, you update the firmware and you have additional features, and one of them is Flex Fuel, which is great. So I bought an ECA2. I've got it uh, wired in. Sensor is on my fuel return line. Um, the the issue I'm seeing is that the ethanol content displayed on the Zetronics hacker display does not match what I see reported in NizTune and I'm not sure why so I'm going to demonstrate what it's doing real quick okay Making sure it's synced up there. Okay, so 25% is what it's reporting in NizTune. And on the gauge, if you can see it right there, it's E9. So it's saying 9%, this is saying 25%. Um, as far as the voltage I'm getting, this is the white and blue cable on the Zetronics which is the analog 0 to 5 foot it's 5 volt output and that goes into the ECU to the uh, right under here the VR229 pin where the uh, the one on the left where the uh, potentiometer for putting it in um, troubleshooting mode and all that stuff um, you take that off and you go to this particular solder pin so that is all soldered up correctly um, and I've noticed different voltages depending on how I have it hooked up to so like right now with it not hooked to from the ECU to the Zetronics that wire is just disconnected right there this is the analog output seeing 0.485 volts now this is the wire that comes from the ECU that's supposed to send that signal in. That's 5.2 volts initially. But when I actually join them together and test that, now I'm at 1.31 volts. which out of a 5 volt signal 1.31 would be uh, approximately a fourth which would be about 25 percent so that kind of makes sense why I'd see 25 percent here the problem is those numbers don't match and I've done a little test here with a, another ethanol sensor I, I have and uh, what I did is I kept one end of this off uh, this is the Continental GM 13577394 um, I kept one end off, put E85 in it, kept the other end off, so this way I can plug it in in place of what's in there now and see what difference I see in the, in the readings. So I'm going to swap this real quick. Oh. So here's where it goes into the return line if we're going back to the tank. So I'm plugging that in, that's pure E85 there. Okay, now ethanol content in uh, Niztune is it showing 92%? And the gauge, hope you can see that, is showing E90. So that's actually pretty close. It's just down low, they don't match up. Let's see what the voltage is now on this pin as they're connected. So 4.6 volts is what it, went, what it went up to. And with this wire disconnected, and if I'm just sensing this analog output from the Zetronics, it's now about the same, 4.6 volts. So it seems to be okay up top, but it's down low. It's not, it's off by quite a bit. 25% um, reading on this tune, 9% reading on the gauge. So. 
Um, hopefully I'll post this up on the News 10 forums and uh, be able to figure out what could be causing this.